Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome to another video by Danica Blue 43. And today we will be taking a look at Snot Rod from the 2016 Sheriff's and Pounds Lost series from Disney Pixar Cars. I do like the art frame. I've always loved it, even though it's some chill in the six, there's something about it that I kind of like. I do like the background for it, it is a sheriff's impound lot, and it looks very detailed. He's number one out of six in the series. On the back, we see a nice picture of the tar tuners pulling Bessie while they got splattered with tar. And I feel like they would make perfect releases to put, because they would have fit in perfectly in the series, but unfortunately, Mattel only released the regular tuners. And hopefully do get the tar tuners one day. And I actually recently did a tune, tar tuners customs video that I got from a good friend of mine called Foxfield Drive. And I really thank him for giving me the customs. And if you like to check my, that out, you can go to the channels and you can watch it if you like. But anyway, on the back we see the cars Wingo, DJ Boost, and Sheriff. Along with the description it reads... Tuners are caught speeding through Radiator Springs. Sure puts them in an impound near since the tow Betsy. Now unfortunately this snarler has tape on the packaging, so I'm gonna have to open it from the bottom. Here's not right out of the box, and like I said, I took efforts to get it out. I had to open it from the bottom. So if it is tape on the car, guys, I really recommend opening it from the bottom. It's easier to get out. But anyway, let's get back to the reveal. He, of course, has a very nice determined expression. He is looking happy like something good happened, at least to him, because, you know, he's a delinquent road hazard. And he does have his, of course, gray rod right here, and it has these two, I mean, actually three, red fumes or whatever you like to call them, like the snot, like, holes. Like, I've always thought to it as a nose to me, so that's what I think of them. And he, of course, is a basic orange color. He has a black stripe on each side of him and the snot and snot rod right there. And he has smaller wheels in the front and bigger wheels in the back with a red outlining on all the tires, but not like on the far side. There's a stripe going around like the middle of the tires rims. But I do like his tires very, very nice. There is his rod, like his engine, where his engine res and his flames come up. Here's a look at the base. It is completely gray and it does have some leak. It's how legal jargon like Disney Pixar made in China. It's how 1186NJ1NL and some other stuff as well. He, of course, has flat eyelids because that's what they do with their cars nowadays because, of course, the cut costs, but I don't mind it. He does have a nice grill with S slash R right there, which, of course, stands for Snot Rod himself. And on the back, we see a black stripe coming from the like connecting the headlights, and it, of course has an S slash R in a circle, standing for Snot Rod. And his license plate reads, of course, his name Snot Rod. And on the top, I'm not sure what this says on the text above it, but it kind of looks like it says, Mar like. Marine City. I'm going to take a look at it and it does... Oh, it actually says Drag City. My bad. I was looking at it wrong. But anyway, he does have nice gray windows. And I don't know if you guys can see it. There's a good shot on the camera. You can see like these two black bars in the window. Probably to hold the car together. I think you saw it from there if you haven't. And... He is one piece. He doesn't have a mouth plate. They used to do it like back... Like, especially in 2010, Mattel has kind of been big on putting mouth plates on cars. But thankfully, nowadays, they barely do that anymore. So that's a good thing. And this snot rod is a variant. Now, the reason why it's a variant is because it actually is a kind of a, com a different shade of orange. Now, I do not have a, or a regular snot rod like the old one to compare it to i mean i do but it's completely broken because that was one when the movie came out so i obviously plays with them so i'm finally glad that i did get a replacement and a better version and it is a, comp a different shade it actually has a different color um rod and a different color license plate because before the license plate color was white but even on impound snot rod 
and stuff like that. Um, they used a white license plate, so I'm kind of glad that they upgraded him a little bit. I definitely prefer this better. And that's kind of it for Snot Rod for today. Tell me guys in the comment section below which variation of Snot Rod is your favorite. It, or maybe which version I should say. It could be regular Snot Rod. It may be. And mine is definitely the Tar Snot Rod. But since that wasn't released, I will have to say Snot Rod with Flames. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more videos. And I'll see you guys by then. Signing off.